Hello, my name is Angel Dude at 228, and today I would like to talk to you about ginseng. Now, ginseng is commonly used in energy drinks, but ginseng is also can be used for health and well-being. Um, I don't really have a favorite type of ginseng. The best type I think that you should buy if you're going to look into be buying a herbal uh, pill form or the actual um, uh, root itself, you can buy that. But the best kind you sh should buy is the Korean red ginseng because it has more ganglios in them and uh, that helps with brain activity and it actually does help with um, brain activity and you can concentrate better in class and stuff if you're studying for exam or something but it w won't give you a like it's not an energy booster it is a stimulant but it's not like drinking coffee it's more or less like if you were to take study for a test and the next day you would know what you study for it, it's basically a smart pill, so, uh, there's no side effects for taking ginseng, but, um, it also can increase your libido, if you want to do that too, um, also, if you're going to take it, and you're taking other, uh, medication, consult your doctor or your herbalist, before taking ginseng, because I don't know how ginseng interacts with heart medication or depression medication or whatever kind of medication you're on. So, um, if you want to take ginseng, take uh, red cream ginseng. Or, or, hold on, where's the other one? Or the royal jelly ginseng. And the, the reason why they call it royal jelly ginseng is because. Um, bees make jelly for the queen that lasts, um, nine years in the honeycomb hive, and, and it's royal, it's only for the queen, and takes nine years to make, so, that's why they call it royal jelly, ginseng. Okay, this is a Angel Dude at 228, and I hope you like my little bit on ginseng. Thank you, bye.